The tackle comes over here, Sean Coleman, with two receivers. Here's Kaiser with a pump fake, going long down the left sideline. That bounce caught. Kenny Britt's got it down the far left sideline. Inside the Colt 35-30, down to the 27-yard line. All right, Coach, let's take a look here at something that you are the creator of, one of these formations that, by the way, people love in Madden, and Browns fans certainly like it here. Let's pause it right here. What are you trying to do here with a formation? Well, we're trying to make sure that we spread the defense out and create holes and spaces in the defense so that we can tack them a couple of different ways. Okay, so is the read for the quarterback based on how they align with it? I imagine there's got to be a run option. Absolutely. Okay. So what is he looking at right so now? So we're looking at the shell of the coverage of the secondary, and obviously it looks like a two shell. As you can see up top, the safety's down a lot lower than the safety is back here. We have some inside slants going with some wides going down the sideline for potential big plays. And if those things aren't there, then we have the potential to run the ball. Okay, all right, so we'll run it through, and you see the motion here. So here's the slants and then the wings, and boom, the ball comes out to Kenny Britt down the sideline for a big play. I remember this formation last year, I want to say, and you got Isaiah Crowell running down the middle of the field Absolutely. for a big play in one of those games. So you see it here for Deshaun. Is it a quick read for him to know where to go with the ball here? Yes. Again, it's a two high, single high situation for us. This is a two high. We love to throw the ball because we know their potential to pressure us is not much. So we'll have a chance to throw it. Rather, like I said, we throw the slants in there. Or we throw it down the boundary to the, to the receivers. And what do you think about the throw here? Quarterback standing in pretty tough here. That's a pretty good throw as he's getting a big man pushed into him there. <laughs> that is a great throw under duress. It certainly is, and a nice catch from Kenny Britt. Next time we'll kind of push him <laughs> in and keep him in bounds for yeah, the touchdown. If we could keep him in for the touchdown, that would have been awesome. So is this something that you love to put on tape as well because now every team's going to have to prepare for it and you probably have an A, a B, a C, a D out of this same And an E, and an F, and a G. you got to have it because what happens is they have to practice against it. There's a lot of different things we do out of these different spread formations. We'll show it. We'll leave it alone. They'll practice it extremely hard. We'll come back to it a couple weeks and away we go. All right, we hope to see it again. More big plays just like this one. And we'll leave you with that, and we'll be back with more of the Hugh Jackson Show right after this.